Hey friends, it's time to think Christmas and I have a great activity for you to do. I did this with my kindergartners last year. So I had all of these little plastic balls and you just take the top of it out. And then I had the children standing up against the wall. They stood up as straight as they could. And I took a pencil <laughs> and I marked on the wall a line to saying how tall they were. And then we got out some ribbon and measured off the ribbon all the way down to show how tall they were. And I said, that's how tall you are this Christmas. And so here's what we're gonna do. We cut the ribbon off. I said, you need to put all the ribbon inside the ball. This will show your mom and dad, your whole family, how tall you were at this Christmas. And so I use some, uh, it's kind of thinner, it's not real thick uh, Christmas ribbon that I got. I found a bunch at the dollar store. I mean, that's an excellent place to go if you're trying to just get some Christmas ribbon. And this, this one says Merry Christmas, but we had plaid and we had glittery type of ribbon. Um, and that way the boys and girls got to choose. This one was red, um, cause I liked that one the best, but the, some of the boys and girls liked the blue. Uh, they liked the plaid, that was just fine. Um, I think I liked this one because it said uh, Merry Christmas on it. So you get all of the ribbon in there. I had a really tall one. <laughs> so I actually put a mark on the wall and then I wrote their name next to the mark, you know, just like your grandma used to do in, in her house. And uh, so anyway, when they've been coming in the door, they've been looking to see if their name is still there. I just hope that the guy who's in charge of our building doesn't come in and see it. Anyway, yeah, I just wrote it with a pencil, so it'll be fine. I think this ribbon was actually longer <laughs> than a child's height. They didn't look this stuffed. All right, so once you get all your ribbon in there, and it looks really good, it says Merry Christmas where you can see the ribbon, then you wanna put the cap back on, and you can help do that if they have trouble with that. All right, and then I have a little poem, and you can download it and, uh, and put it on your, um, on your ornaments as well. But I had each child sign their name, and then I wrote, the year on there, so 2023, and I had them write their name. And it says, I'm growing and changing a bit more each year, so I made a special ornament to capture this time you hold dear. Look closely at the ribbon and you will see it's the very same size as me. The ribbon inside of this little ball will remind you of a time when I was this tall. Year after year, as it hangs on your tree, you'll be reminded of a much smaller me. Isn't that sweet? And so I have the chenille stem. I probably only need about half of it. Of course, I went with the silver sparkly. You can do whatever. You can use ribbon if you want to use ribbon. But I wanted to tie it on to this, so that way they would see the ribbon as well. And if you wanted to use like some paint pens or uh, markers or something to actually write on the ornament yourself, you could do that. That would be absolutely fine. But this is a great little gift to send home and remember this year was a special year in this child's life. I hope you'll give it a try. <laughs>